my YouTube channel, Pretty Bibliophile, and here I talk all about books. So if you like my content, make sure to like, share, and subscribe this video. So firstly, I want to thank you all for all the love that you have showered upon my first video. It was awesome. And yesterday when I got this email from uh, YouTube saying that congratulations, you've got your first 100 subscribers, I was like, whoa, that was fast. I mean, I knew I had 100 followers, but the realization had to come upon me yet. And so that email was like a big deal. But yeah, thank you so much for all the love you have showered upon me so far. So in today's video, I wanted to create a reading nook specifically for autumn. Uh, in the first video, I had shot the whole scene in front of my living room bookshelf and so in this video I'm going to um, completely revamp it. So what I intend to do is that I will be arranging all the books in the shelf um, with the autumn theme in mind and then I'm going to create a reading nook which looks cozy and just very photogenic of course. So that's pretty much it, that's the idea and if you want to see any particular um, topic then make sure to comment below I would love to uh, try them all out and yeah comment below about what your plans are for reading specifically this uh, autumn and then December and I'll see you guys soon I hope you enjoy the video make sure to like share and subscribe so hey guys I just wanted to give you a glimpse of this corner of my living room because pretty soon it will be different and yeah this is the area where I am going to set up my autumn nook so let's just see which books have otherwise kept my knees crack a lot yeah I'm a grandma <laughs> so these are the books that are here uh, mostly these are Indian mythological books and then I have a few thrillers and then some Daniel Seed books and these are just some decorative pieces now this bookshelf itself it used to be my mom's back when she was a student a kid herself actually so it's a piece of heritage for me so yeah this is it and it will be very different very soon i hope you enjoy the video so first up these two sofas are moving out first off i'm going to be cleaning all this uh, I'm gonna be removing the books basically. So I've got on, I've put on some music. Um, Lana Del Rey, Goodbye Kiss. The tripod is standing on the laptop, so that's why I'm peeking behind it. But yeah, it's one of my favorite songs ever. I don't know if it's an original by Lana Del Rey or if it's just a cover, but it's beautiful. Out of this world chef's kiss it's beautiful so as you can see i have started by removing the two glass items because they're made of glass and if you break the glass your mom's gonna break your bones i think that's a universal truth
the bookshelf looks without any books and these are the books that were there I have not counted actually but I surely am going to because I want to know the capacity and then keep that number in mind when I bring the other books in I'm going to start by sorting the books according to their spine colors because since this is autumn themed I want to concentrate on uh, brown a bit of yellow maybe orange and red just a bit of red and just a bit of yellow so this is the um, my actual bookshelf which is in my bedroom it's a bit dirty but um, well it's my bookshelf and it's it's my baby so yeah um, on this shelf the shelf and the shelf uh, the books are kept in just one row each but on the topmost here except these Harry Potter Jim K editions there are two um, two rows two columns but whatever so yeah we have two stacks um, lying one after the other so there is another one on the other side towards the wall so yeah from here I'm gonna collect some books which I think will work well with my autumn theme but the obvious two first two choices are my priori of the orange tree books uh, this one is a finished copy and this one is the um, proof copy that I had got from Bloomsbury and maybe Circe yeah that's a good one so I have collected a few books whose spines I think will definitely do justice to um, the whole theme. I think they will but it's like a trial and error method anyway so I'll just play around and this one doesn't match. I just took out the whole Philippa Gregory set I had so yeah. If there's one book that I think from here um, truly emulates the autumn vibe it has to be spell book of the lost and found the title even is very witchy i think because of the spell book and the thorn buds by colin mccullo is very pretty i think yeah so i'll carry these to my living room and we'll see how it goes so these are the books that i have for um, these, these, all of these, 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 and these, they are from the shelf itself, um, as well as these, and, um, till here, till Amish. Yeah, so these are all from here, so these are the ones that I brought, which, I don't know why I get, I'm getting this blue tint, but, yeah, these are the ones that I got, which I think, at least these ones are really, really, very autumn-y, so, I'll start with those and then we'll go from there.
with the autumn themed bookshelf this is how it looks right now and um, I quite like it however this is just a bookshelf the reading nook is yet to be made which the idea that I have for it is um, quite easy but cozy one so yeah stay tuned for that as well so what I've done is I've added um, sort of a mattress here and then use a white um, Bed sheet. I already have yellow slash orange curtains so that will really help with the theme and then with this um, brown background and everything I think my look will be quite good so yeah yes to hoping so this is a sort of custom uh, wallpaper that I made to you know help serve as a background for all my books and pictures it's just old pages stuck on four calendars yeah so that's how I made this one and I've just stuck it up here I could not um, shoot this I actually did but I look so bad and I'm not gonna put that clip but yeah I have put this on behind the um, bookshelf so this will give some sort of a texture some sort of depth to the whole um, effect at the end so what I'm going to do to make this area more comfortable is I'm simply going to add some cushions because I think that um, cushions really make a place very comfortable and look very cozy. Feel free to add any cushion sort of cushions you want but I'm going to put um, put this brown ones which I already have and they really go with my theme as well I suppose. So yeah this is how it's going to be and like for sure I'm just gonna keep this two here and then two mini ones will go here so this is the end effect I'm also gonna put the stool here which is quite a beautiful stool because it's made of um, cane I think yeah, it's cane handicraft and that's why it looks so good and what I'm gonna add to this put on top of it, forgive that noise, is this um, typewriter because I think it makes everything look a lot more better. So the last thing that I'm going to add to tie it all together is simple fairy lights. Uh, we also have Diwali coming along soon. So these are, um, you know, available everywhere in India. So yeah, this is what I'm going to use to tie this entire thing together. So everything is almost ready. The last thing that you need to do is what you always need to do to make any place cozy. And that is to use candles. Uh, the one I have here is from Storyteller. It's the Ravenclaw because, um, can you see it? Because I'm a Ravenclaw myself. So yeah, this is the one that I got. And I also have a couple more. So I'll just light them up i really had a lot of fun shooting this video i hope it comes out nicely when i'm editing it because i did have to uh i think i will have to edit some parts out because um some are not that good so yeah that's what is gonna be so it's just lighted up so it looks so pretty and especially when the lights are off if you have candles on it's just amazing because mm, and this one smells so good my favorite candle smell is um, bamboo bamboo and fresh grass that's like the best thing that could ever the best smell ever and Um, I just, you know, I think the way I started to have the idea for this video is kind of strange really because I just suddenly had this idea that I have to do an autumn themed um, video because especially now that autumn is coming along and everybody is doing all these things and autumn is um such a nice cozy weather but however the truth is sort of the truth in india we don't really have autumn 
it's still very warm in the mornings um it only gets cold at night and i have to use a blanket and that's it during the day it's very hot and nobody uses people are still using umbrellas to shield themselves from the heat from the sun so that's how hot it still is and um it's just at night that it gets cozy but we have diwali and as soon as diwali ends it will start to get very cold and i have such mixed feelings for winter i don't really like winter because i have to wear such a lot of clothes because it's winter and i cannot bear the cold it's actually night when i'm filming this and that's why my brain is half dead and i'm pausing so much but okay now the smells from the ca candles are coming out and it's really nice this one is um from iris uh, home fragrances it's a bamboo shoot green tea and bamboo yeah this is the one that i really love it had six i finished two i bought them recently and this is the second no this is the first pack itself but i've been very miserly in using it so that's why um i still have four left which i'll be using over the course of you know autumn as we progress into winter and as winter starts also i suppose so i'll just um place them very nicely over all the areas and then um maybe click a couple of photos and we can proceed from there so um hey everyone my final changes for this video is done for the <laughs> the shoots and um i've lit the candles and i've just got to switch off the lights and show you the wonderland that this has become so yeah without further ado let's do that this is how the area looks with only the candles on so let's first switch off the light be prepared because it's no whatever i'm just gonna switch on the um fairy lights and then even i don't know how it it's gonna look so, because i haven't done it before this is the first um, all right so let's see one two three this is pretty Tisha, can you switch off that light please run go that was my brother he has been sitting here watching me and this is i mean isn't this the coziest place ever where you can just sit and have some nice tea or drinks or whatever you want and just read books cuddle up with your loved ones watch movies or you know all that jazz it's just you now i feel like sleeping here instead of going back to my bed but this is so so pretty i love this and um wow if i say so myself yeah this is this is really pretty i'll have to click a few pictures and then yeah wow i'm so excited for you all guys to see this mm -hmm. 